uh, here in the countryside behind Barcelona called Sorolla National Park. I spoke in a previous video about the power of stories. Stories to shift perspective, stories to motivate, stories to share an idea. For me, a very powerful story is, is one about what we're blind to. We're blind to what we can't understand. We're blind when we believe we know. But the story, this is Papua New Guinea. Papua New Guinea, there was about 20 years ago, a tribe that was newly discovered. And sociologists and psychologists were very excited to go and understand this culture of the, the tribe. What were their rituals? How were they as a people? And the, the psychologist organized that five members of this Papua New Guinea tribe that lived in the mountains would come down and see Singapore. They would see the skyscrapers, they would see the airport, they would see factories, they would see hotel, they would see supermarkets, they would see people's homes. And so the, they had seen all of these things and they were returning back to the mountain village of the tribe. And on the last route up into the mountains, sitting in the back of the truck, the psychologists had built a bit of a bond and they asked the group of uh, the tribe, of all that you've seen, what is it that has most excited you? And the five members of the tribe very excitedly started to discuss between the, each other. The psychologists were thinking, will they talk about skyscrapers? Will they talk about supermarket? Will it be the farming methods? After some deliberation, the group shared what they were most inspired by. The answer, the thing that had most struck them, the wheelbarrow. This group had seen a couple of workmen on a building site using a wheelbarrow to move some bricks. And a wheelbarrow was the one thing that they saw in Western civilization that they could see how this applied and made a difference to their lives. And they were super excited to get back to their tribe and share the wheelbarrow, how it would make their lives easier. Everything about the factory, everything about the supermarket, it all was so advanced that it just flew over their heads. There's a saying that anything that is beyond our idea of, of imagination just feels like uh, science fiction. So to these, to these tribe people, the factories, the supermarkets, it was science fiction. It was beyond their capacity to understand. It was only the wheelbarrow that they could see an immediate practical use in their own society. And I love this story because we are also tribes people in this universe. And some of the most inspiring things around us we are blind to because we're looking for the wheelbarrow when in front of us is skyscrapers and all sorts of things. So here's my daughter coming back from the mountain. We've got them all heading back to their camp. Yurana, Salt de la Reina Mora, where a princess jumped on her horse to her death to avoid being captured. Better come. This is where we're gonna make videos that will skyrocket subscribers, likes, views, all the things that really matter in life.